might like to call the meeting to order tonight with the Pledge of Allegiance, please. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Thank you and welcome everybody here tonight. Roll call, Mr. Lundberg. Oh. Yes. Oh. Yeah. Hagman. Yep. Clapp. Yes. Schrader. Yes. All right. Are there any questions on the agenda that we have in front of us tonight? If not, I would entertain a motion to approve the agenda as presented. I move to approve tonight's agenda. Second. There's been a first and a second. All those in favor? Aye. Aye. Opposed? Motion passes. Thank you. There are no conflict of interest disclosure or waiver requests on the agenda tonight and no community input. So that takes us to our general business items. First one we have under that is administration reports, the high school one-to-one -one initiative report. Dr. Talcott. tonight we're going to take you to another place we're going to go to one of the collaboration rooms there are six um, kind of pods if you will seven actually but six set up and uh, there is a teacher at each of those or at six of those places and so we have a spot for each of the board members and the superintendent so you guys just go sit at any one of the six and then once we start we'll rotate clockwise after that so you'll be one-on-one -on -one with a teacher for about three minutes so they're not even going to introduce themselves. It says right above them the sign what their name is and what they teach. They're just going to go. So you're going to learn about uh, the communication things that we use with Schoology and uh, Google Classroom. One of them will talk to you about that. Another one's going to talk to you a little bit about she surveyed 150 of her kids and just give you some reflection on what, what they found there. The sign language teacher is going to show you how she does some of the video things and how she can assess her kids and how the computers help. We've got Spanish teachers talking to you about some of the language things that they do. Matt Christensen has uh, a group of his students who have volunteered some are on site and some are off site and they're going to use Google Docs to uh, literally work on a paper that they're currently working on and you'll see that process Google Docs is important for you to learn a little bit about because well, the other thing that we're doing is we're creating a Google Doc or actually Google Slides that will um, demonstrate what other teachers are doing because we obviously can't bring everybody in uh, and so that will demonstrate, and then once we get that created, we'll just give you access to that. So then you can go in and, and say, well, here, I want to look at some other examples of other things that are being done in classrooms. So we're at about a halfway point, obviously, in the first year. This is a $1.4 million initiative, and we think it's worth some time to see how it's going so far, how it's being used by teachers, but more importantly, um, what it's doing for students in the classroom and outside the classroom walls. So we're going to go down to Collaboration Lab. So uh, it's, it's room 128, which is kind of down the senior hallway, but we'll take you down there, and again, once you get in there, just go find somebody to sit there, and we'll kind of time you and say, okay, you got three minutes and rotate. Uh, if you find something really interesting or you want more, uh, just, you know, communicate with that teacher later or whatever and ask more questions, but we really need to kind of keep you circulating and so forth, and uh, so unlike parent-teacher conferences, nobody gets to dominate a table. You got to move, okay? So we're going to head down to uh, room 128. And for the viewing public, you're going to head along with us via camera. So come on along.
Are you going to show my screen? Because I'm going to have kids' names on here. And the clock is starting. Okay, I can't I can get it. You'll make it so you can't see the kids' names? Or does it matter? I don't think you're going to be able to read it. Okay. All right. This is a website I know. This will be five. I've been using the title. It's covered under the list.org. And it is, um, there's some sort of thing around it, but it's largely nonfiction text. And it's very text dependent. And it's quite a lot of things. So, and then everything goes in. Like, for example, this file you read, and it's all about waiting past the week. And it's all about 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 the week. And it's Concept of the Japanese So we read this article, and this is um, you read this, it's about guided reading, and they put the season and it helps them out here. They also have very text dependent questions that they have to answer as part of the assessment. They have a, um, four or five short, uh, multiple choice, and then we've got a short answer question that I go back through with three. So that's this, they can play it, pause it, stop it, highlight it, and change their settings. They can do all sorts of to customize it for yourself. They can increase their font size. They have a bit of a have large print. So it does it right there. Um, it's got no teacher guides and stuff. So they can do this. And we also have there's related text. These are other articles that are related to that cover some of the same topics. And we don't have those, but we did go back and do this. And so this was just a handed video that they could go and watch on YouTube. And it was descendants of people who were in the camp, went back to Manzanar and told it. This is a video of that camp in the present day. So they got it in the textbook, they get it with the article, they get it with the video. So it's for the whole. And it's got, you know, teacher guides and parent guides. And this is what I use. And I love it because um, it connects. And they can make so many connections between things. And so if I go to Oh, I so to 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 to
anniversary for kids. So, you know, my has it, oh, it has it, it has it. Um, another way we do get a kids to please, we don't just do it. We have all of these tools with the wheels. All right, we have a 30 seconds to kind of wrap up this station. They get on that one, they go out and take pictures of theirs. All of that comes into the stage, you know, organized action, and then it's just a great and great Me too! Awesome! This means you would just let them go. So they can put all the stage on where the phone's all the videos, all of that, and it looks like a special thing. They can even like it, and they can hide it. This was a conversation about something, and so they're not going to the best in party actors. And so this guy's All right, that was it for this station. I think you're moving on to your final station, is that right? The best and the worst for both players. We're going to your last station now. Totally, yes. It could be love it, because like I said, it's always a supplement. Because I can't cover anything, then it's supplement, supplement. I brought my helper. Well, I'm trying to get her out of it. She didn't want to be able to so we have it with RV. Um, some of our people are making it. RV is a catalyst. It's a love and hurt. So what we do is an act of great on this. I'm supposed to tell you all about how communication is to me. What they do is they'll So this is something they are doing. I mean, you're all Spanish, but I don't this is where you can just have to have a little bit of practice, and I'm going to finish everything. So, I should bring things. These are all high schools. They shoot with kids, and just one of the finest, and it takes two extra two minutes, probably enough. Yeah, then what they're going to love it, they have to record it. No, 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 this is no problem. It's just a learning app. It's a web app. It's a web app. Wow. It's a web app.
Mr. Vlamick has given me the thumbs up that we can get back started. I um, just want to thank the high school administration and Dr. Talcott and Mr. Schleckaway for that um, demonstration. And for those of you who are viewing um, this on TV and might find it of interest, you're not going to probably get real good audio and be able to hear. But um, if you're really interested, it is open to the community, this kind of investment, like Dr. Talcott had just said. If someone's interested and wants to come in and see how it's used in the classroom, feel free to call him, and he will set up a time to come visit and kind of watch the kids in action using um, the computers and, and the teachers with the instruction. So invite the public to do that. All right, next we have general business. Um, looks like adopt the 2017-2018 school calendar. Superintendent Larson. We'd certainly entertain any questions um, or items. Otherwise, we would uh, we'd look for action to adopt um, the previously distributed 17-18 academic school calendar. Any questions for Superintendent Larson at all on the calendar? If not, I would entertain a motion to adopt the 2017-18 calendar as presented. So moved. Yep. There's been a first and a second. All those in favor? Aye. Opposed? Motion passes. Thank you. That takes us to personnel. There are five items there for us for consent approval. I would entertain a motion to approve those as presented. So moved. Second. Aye. There's been a first and a second. All those in favor? Aye. Opposed? Motion passes. Um, there are a couple thank you notes there for your review for the Board of Education. And then that takes us to board reports. Does anyone have a formal board report they would like to give tonight? Um, an alternative ed, things are kind of status quo. Uh, working on different things. Joan has been out talking to superintendents um, about contracts and why we do the things we do with the um, alternative edit teach well so if there's any questions with that you can certainly call me or ask me or contact Joan Friedrich so that's what I have from that any other committees all right if not there's one travel report there for your review and with that that takes us to the end of our regularly scheduled meeting I would entertain a motion to adjourn so moved. So moved. I so moved. I so moved. Second. <laughs> There's been a first and a second. All those in favor? Aye. Opposed? Motion passes. Thank you very much.